Hi, it's Tessa, and I just got back from Rite Aid, so I wanted to do a Rite Aid haul. But before I get into that, I wanted to talk about another company, or online company, called OneCellAday.com. They sell all kinds of things. They sell sheets and kitchen stuff and jewelry and watches and all kinds of things. But I wanted to show you, last year on that website, I got this ring. And it's a sterling silver white topaz. And it was $7.95. And it's free shipping. And then recently, I just bought this ring, which is sterling silver and black diamonds. It's really pretty. And it comes in a box like this, in a little bag, and it was $7.95 also. The only thing I want to say about the company is shipping is extremely slow, so don't expect it for two, maybe even three weeks. But for $7.95, you're really getting a good deal, and it's, you know, no more um, expensive than buying costume jewelry, but it's actually real jewelry. So if you have a chance to check out One Cell A Day, I'll leave the link below. Um, it's one, like the number one, celladay.com. All right, on to my Rite Aid haul. I got all kinds of stuff today. And I also wanted to mention when going to Rite Aid, there's two things that you can do to help save money. And you can use them on sale items. The first one is to go to your wellness card on their website and load to card coupons. The other thing is to go on to coupons.com and you'll print out little coupons like this. This one happens to be for Maybelline New York Foundation, $2 off. This one's for Walmart. They'll look like this and you can just take them to the store and use them like any other coupon and that'll help save you some money. And at Rite Aid you can use them on sale items, clearance items, whatever. So the first thing I got today at Rite Aid is the Dickinson Witch Hazel, which I use all the time. and. This was, I brought my sales receipt in, and look, this is a ridiculously long sales receipt. So give me a second till I find out how much it was. And I will let you know here. Which Hazel? This is regular $6.29, and I got it for $4.99. So there's that. Then, let me grab all these. Here. Elme was $5.99 for all their eye products. And then I had printed out on coupons.com a $3 coupon. So I got $5.99 each, plus I got the um, $3 coupon. So the two things I got is the Elme One Coat Get Up and Grow Mascara. I've always wanted to try this mascara, and since it was on sale, I decided to pick it up. And I also got the Elme Intense Eye Color Shadow Stick, and this is for blue eyes. And it has, the top part is like a, a brown, and the bottom is like a gold. It looks like this. I'm not going to open and swatch any of this stuff. I think I'm going to save them for later videos, because I haven't talked about this, but in 2014, I'm going to do a no-buy, low-buy kind of thing. I'm still working out all the details, but whenever I finish with that, I'll be sure to let you know. So I think I'm going to save a lot of these products to review into the next year so I have some things to talk about because I won't be buying anything new. And the Elme um, eyeshadow stick was regular $8.29 and I got it for $5.99 and $1.50 off that one. And then the Elme Get Up and Grow was regular $8.29 I got it for $5.99 and then $1.50 off that. Then I bought the CoverGirl Lash Perfection Mascara, which was on clearance 75% off, and that was regular, I'm sorry, it's taken me a second to find this stuff, um, it was regular $7.19, and I got it for $1.19, so great deal there. Right now, um, my Rite Aid was having a ton of 50% off items, so, or 75% off, I'm sorry, so I got a bunch of them. Then I also picked up, what did I get? NYC this week is having, I'm going to have to load this today, so the sale just started today, and then anybody that wants to get sale items can. 
NYC was having, if you spend $5 in products, you get $2 back in up rewards. So I got five things, plus they were 30% off. So the first thing I got is the NYC Cold Brow Eyeliner. I'm going to use this, or try to use this on my brows. It's in taupe. It looks like this. And this was... Regular 99 cents, and I got it for 69 cents. Then I got two of the NYC Sparkle Eye Dust eyeshadows. I have one already, and I really liked it. So since these are on sale, I bought two of them. And they are Champagne, Golden Champagne, and Bronze Shimmer. And these were regular $2.99 on sale for $2.09 each. So I got those. And then I've never tried any of the NYC mascaras, so I bought one in the Sky Rise and City Curls. And these were regular $1.99, and I got them this one for $1.39. And this was $2.99, and I got it for $2.09. So great deals on that. Then I found this, and my friend Deanna loves this stuff. Um, it's the CoverGirl in LA pressed powder, and I got it in light, and it was on clearance, and I'm not sure if they're doing away with these or what, but I picked this one up to try because she always raves about it. This is regular $14.29, and I got it for $3.57. Then I picked up the Revlon Photo Ready Bronzer in Bronzed and Chic. Chic. And um, this was regular $12.99, and I got it for $3.24, so that's a really good deal. I also got three eyeshadow singles that were on clearance, all from L'Oreal. The first one is called Morning Light, and it has a clearance sticker right over the cover. Let me see if I can peel it off so you can see the color of it. There's this one. It's really pretty. Um, if you can hear a noise in the background, people are driving their snowmobiles. This is regular $4.89 and I got it for $2.44. Then I got this one and the color is Glistening Sea. And it was regular $4.89, and I got it for $2.44. And it's like a greenish blue, and it looks like it has a duochrome in it. Then the last one I got was this one, and the color is Gilded Bronze. And it was $4.89, and I got it for $2.44. There's that, and two more things. The one thing I got that wasn't on sale... <laughs> But I was eyeing it up for a long time, and with my no-buy next year, and this is limited edition, I thought I better pick it up because I won't be able to get it later, and it'll be gone. This is called Hors d'Oeuvres, and it's an Essie nail polish, and it's like a silver, gold, pink, and purple glitter. It is so pretty. I don't know if the camera will do it this justice, but I mean, it is... It screams holiday, winter to me, and I just thought it was the most beautiful nail polish I've ever seen. And I seen it in there the last time, and I put it back because this is a little more expensive than the regular Essie polishes. This one is $8.50. Um, I'm a silver wellness card member at Rite Aid, so I also get... I think 10 or 15% off of all my almost all my purchases. Not all of them, but almost all of them. So I did get my discount, so it was $7.65. But that's pretty expensive for nail polish. And the very last thing I bought, I had a coupon for it also. I had a coupon for $2 off. And this is the Revlon Color Burst. Um, what do you want to call it? Matte Balm. Lipstick, and the color is Sultry, number 225. I don't think you'll be able to see that, but 
it is on there. And this one was not on sale, but I had the coupon. Revlon. Revlon. There was $8.99, and I got $2 off. So there's that. And I'm going to swatch this one because it is open. And color looks like that. So that's everything I got at Rite Aid. It has a very minty scent. I have lipstick on now, but I'm going to put this on over top just to see what it looks like. Pretty. Very, very pretty. So that's everything I got at Rite Aid, and I'm stocked up for a while on mascara because after my no-buy, I don't care how much of a sale it is, I ain't going to be able to buy it. Um, so, like I said, I'm working on that, and as soon as I get all the stuff finalized, I will get back to you with my list of rules and what's going to happen in 2014. So until then, I will see you again soon, and I think I'm also going to have to do my year-end favorites for makeup and things like that, so I'll be filming that soon as well. Alright, thanks. Bye-bye.